Hello everyone, and welcome back to Amnesia. Tonight we are playing Amnesia again. It's night outside. And why are we playing Amnesia? Because it's a very fun game to play. And excuse me, I'm kind of hungry, so I'm going to be a little bit munching while I'm doing this. Yes. Now, where we last left off, we were on a quest to find the jam monster. Uh, and we encountered a monster. Um, last episode I asked if you... Oh, monitor just went blank. Last week I asked if you guys wanted me to... Um, or last episode, I don't know how long ago that was. I think actually that was a week and a day ago. Um, I asked if you guys wanted me to kind of read ahead and uh, know what's coming up. And uh, no one responded, so I just chose not to. So it'll be kind of confusing and I'm probably going to make some mistakes. But... Um, I reserve the right to use the internet if I so choose, but I haven't yet. So, at any rate, <coughs> I'm currently in this room. I don't really remember. <coughs> Got a um, knockoff healthy weedy stuck in my throat. Um, I don't remember quite what we were. <coughs> no, excuse me. I don't remember quite where we were or what we were doing. Um, I remember we we're in some kind of wine cellar in the store and see. And from what I've heard and what I've learned, um, through a little bit of playing, but mostly just through What's happening? Oh, kind of reading what I've heard, like, um, my chest is going basically, there's, you can't fight the monsters at all, you just have to run and hide and, you know, wait for them to pass. My god, Wilhelm, do something! Except we're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> Cutscene over. So, um, we now know Alexander is a piece of shit, according to the game. That's useful. According to a very reputable third-party source, a random voice that we heard. I didn't bother to figure out who it was. There are smatterings of, looks like, human tissue on the ground. Can I pick it up? No, show me a hand, but I'm not able to pick it up. Got a tinder box here, it looks like. Um, anything else to open? There's a picture. I'll be able to open this. And this. Hmm. I got a box with a bowl on it. Let's play Balance the Bowl on the Box! This sounds fun. Rules. You must balance the bowl on the box. Alright. Oh, no, 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 don't tilt that way. Alright, alright. There we go, there we go. Slowly but surely make our way. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, don't tip it up like that. Oh, we lost the bowl. Well,. It was fun while it lasted. Now it's a hat. Balance the hat on the box. Close enough. Balance the chair on the box. Trust me guys, this is better than the storyline. Dang it. Balance the chair. Eh, whatever. Moving all right along into the creepy deaths. Depth. Deaths. Maybe deaths, but depths. D E P T H S of Amnesia. Um. Uh. Did we come down this way? I kind of think this is the way we came. What is pounding and hands are shaking? I wonder if this light lets us regain sanity. I'm gonna wait here a little bit till we regain sanity. Um, I don't exactly know what happens when you lose sanity, but I'm not sure I want to find out. So, yeah, it's not much to say about it. Um, again, uh, something to talk about with the server, the Minecraft server, and I'm very sorry about this. Uh, recently, we moved over to a new world, uh, Survival New, it's called, because um, it's survival and it's new. Very original name, I must admit. I 
I take full credit for that original name. The originality is just amazing. I'm tired, sorry, I ramble. Uh, so basically, I, um, back when Trig was still with us, uh, he, he has, in case uh, you don't know, he has moved on, uh, not, not died or anything. He, uh, he decided that um, he basically overstayed his welcome with Minecraft as far as, you know, it, it was infringing too much on other things he wanted to do in his life. He wanted to move on, and props to him for, you know, figuring out, you know, hey, I'm not going to get anywhere playing Minecraft all day, and <laughs> look at me. Um, <laughs> I play other games, too, but uh, I actually don't play Minecraft all that much anymore early on the server, but anyway, um, back when he was, uh, still an admin, well, he still is an admin, whenever he comes on, he's still an admin, but, um, back when he was, you know, active and whatnot, he, uh, suggested, he said, and other users were complaining about, uh, lag, and users getting lag, am I regaining sanity from this? I am, alright, let's see if we can get above a slight headache while I talk about this. So, he was, um, a couple other people suggested that I, and I have 3D glasses, that I basically go over and um, make a new world and you know and I was originally going to transfer just um, um, money and MCMMO stats and maybe inventory but probably not so I decided you can see my eyes through the lens even in the dark on the left this one that's cool uh, anyway so I decided to I wonder if Amnesia has 3D options graphics uh, That would be so amazing if we could do 3D, like NVIDIA 3D Vision, which I don't have, but that would be amazing with Amnesia be like so immersive, you know? Um, so anyway, let's begin a little bit more sanity while I talk about this. With, of course, 3D glasses, my sanity leaves as his gains, I guess. Um, we decided, well, I kind of decided with a lot of input from others uh, that we should move over to a new world, and Trig already had his mind made up and was just kind of waiting for me to get on the stick with it. And so I... Um, I made a new world, and uh, people were, you know, oh my god, you can't do that, I have all these buildings, and I was like, yeah, you know, I mean, people have been building for months and months and months on this thing, and it'd be a real shame to see all that go to waste, you know, I'm sure you get to bring your MCMO stats, but then that favors the people who just grind instead of build, and I think building is really fun, uh, I'm personally no good at it, but I do appreciate the art of it, so, um, with, again, a lot of recommendations from other people, I, I decided to move reses over to allow people to basically, um, you know, put in a ticket, essentially, for uh, a res to be moved over. Limited to three per person, but if they had, you know, really cool stuff to bring over, I would, of course, make an exception. It's just to stop people from saying, hey, I have 40 mud huts, bring them over now, you said you would. You know, it's like, oh my god, I hate mud huts. So, um, even though I do build them myself. Where was I going with that? Oh yeah, so we made a new world, and when we made the new world, uh, that was my last backup when we changed over to the new world. And so uh, when reses were still in place there, but um, they weren't, more reses have been made since then. That was my last backup, and it's because I'm running really low on disk space on this computer. I mean, the total amount of storage I need to back up the craft bucket server folder is almost more than the storage I have on this computer right here. This is the server. It's an uh, old iMac, um, like really old, like um, I think four or five years old. So it's still good enough to run a server, but um, doesn't have much storage space at all. So that's partly limiting the backups too. Um, we've been having a lot of issues with kind of the server needed to be restarted a lot, so I was kind of holding out to think maybe I'm going to rebuild the server files, and that never happened. So anyway, we are, uh, let's see how our sanity's doing now. Slight headache. Alright, I don't think we're going to get any better than that, so let's just continue on. Take these off so I can see what's going on, and that looks all weird and like, whoa. <laughs> um, but, regardless, um, so we moved over to new reses, uh, moved over to new world, and everything was going good. Until um, today, the plugin residents like crashed or whatever it did. Right, that could be useful. It crashed and basically ended up with me uh, with um, a corrupted res folder, and so all the reses are gone. So while you say, "Well, why are you, why are you telling this?" You know, a bunch of people are going to grief. It's better that you people know so you can go on and change your reses. And I really apologize for this. I don't want to, you know, have to do this, obviously, but 
You're, you're just gonna have to remake your reses. I, I guess I could use the backup, but I fear the same thing's gonna happen with the backup. It was just kind of a ticking time bomb. Um, although I'm not sure. I, I would, if enough people want, I will revert to that backup. I'm just not sure if it's in everyone's best interests. But uh, I do have the backup from actually yesterday. Right? No, 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 it was before that. Yeah, that's a really old backup. Alright, that's before I moved reses over that that backup is made. So yeah, uh, it wouldn't be ver uh, very much used to revert to that. I have been here before. Hey, look, a chair. Uh, so, I mean, we're just going to have to make new reses, and I'm really sorry, but there's not too much built in the new world already, so just get to it quick and res it if you don't know where it is. Um, uh, I don't know if you have home set there, that's great. Uh, that home set still work if you have if you're already there then great um but I open this entrance hall is this where I came in from I kind of think it is darn um <laughs> I'm just going in circles in this game it's driving me nuts um yeah alright back into the wine cellar we gotta figure this out it became impossible to avoid. The commotion in the streets begged for his attention. As he opened the shutters, the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced in a haze of gun smoke. Ooh, what does that have to do with a storyline? Are these supposed to be related to the storyline? Because if they are, I'm obviously not paying enough attention to the actual storyline that I'm not getting the references. Alright, what's our sandy at? Eh, whatever, we'll just continue on. So yeah, that's the current state of affairs with the Minecraft server. I'm very sorry about that, but uh, we'll have to read you reses if you need any help or whatnot with reses. Um, I will be on a little bit, although I am pretty... Hmm, that's, this might be useful. Strong push right now, so strong push in the direction you face. Hmm, I'm confused now. Hold down left mouse to push. Alright, so push, 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 then right click to... I hurled it in the wrong direction. Alright, whatever. Anyway, so, sorry about that. You will have to remake uh, reses if you need any help with that. Um, I'll be on a little bit, although I'm pretty busy recently. Um, a lot of different things. But, um... Now I'm confused. Confused. I'm gonna light this so my guy can regain some of his sanity. I don't like the the sanity visual effect is kind of a little bit hard to play with, I will admit. Uh let's regain some of the sanity here. I'm still confused as to what happened. I picked up something off the ground and a barrel fell on my head. A few cuts and bruises. Probably from the barrel. Uh whoops. <laughs> Cuprate Clamine. Anyone have any ideas what these things do? Chemistry pot might be useful, actually, with those. But anyway, so you will have to remake reses. Uh, very sorry about that. Uh, I won't be on very much, but uh, some of the admins, other admins might be able to help you. Sold Witch, Hikerak, um, 999 Oblivion, um, uh, Dole 1212. Why am I forgetting these? Uh, any others? I think that's it. Yeah, alright, sorry, whoa, that was weird. So anyway, uh, let me know. Uh, I will be on a little bit, but not too much. Uh, they might be able to help you. Uh, if I'm on, I'd be more than happy to help you, but um, be busy lately with balancing chairs on tables. That's what I'm busy with. Balancing chairs on tables. No, I was, um, I'm currently uh, uh, kind of a co-owner of the second largest uh, pool of uh, the cryptocurrency Litecoin. Which isn't really saying much, considering... Can I light the chair on fire? That'd be awesome. Considering Litecoin is kind of an alternate cryptocurrency, but um, I manage the pool. Uh, Mine.litecoin, M-I-N-E, period, L-I-T-E-C-O, period, I-N. And so I've spent most of the last two days uh, writing uh, API Stats Grabber, an application that basically uh, latches on to a user API key and feeds it hashing rate data um, about the pool uh, network, um, everything like that. Is there a bug crawling on my eyes? Look at that, look at that. Did you see that? That was weird. It's like, what the heck, dude? Um, 
That's very realistic, unless my guy is wearing like giant goggles or a face mask that's invisible. <laughs> Just as I said that, a little bug landed on my screen. Alright, so anyway, uh, that's kind of what's going on in my life right now. Uh, not very much. Um, hunger is kind of a... I think I'm going to make a gross bird. Either that or my body wants to store more body fat, which I hope not. Is it rude to eat while recording a video? No matter how rude it is, it's delicious. Mm. Ow. Well, moving on. Uh, I think my guy regained enough sanity. So we can't really go out that way. Of course. Just to kind of, a little bit blocked, you know. Um... Don't see much of that way. How did I even get in here? A few drops of oil. Alright, so I put a little bit more oil in my thing. Oh, here's another tinder box. That could be useful. Um that was the way we came in, wasn't it? That's my thinking noise. It's also very annoying. Ha! One hit KO. Knock off. Not knock out. Knocked off the table. Can't really see anything in this dark corner. There we go. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can move boulders. Wait. Idea. Move boulder. Move boulder. Move boulder. Move boulder. Not repetitive at all. And move this wood here. Mm -hmm. Can't I go backwards? Rocks blocking my way. Uh, move, 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 move. Move. Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Don't want you here anymore. Go away. Annoying rocks. Actually, I never wanted them here. They kind of blocked my path when I bent down to pick up some, what I thought was kerosene. Lighter fluid for my... Wait a second. Can I even? I don't know if I even can move this out of the way, because it's like... Oh, here. Let's try opening the door. Oh, that's enough to squeeze through. Somehow. No, oh, I thought that was going to be like a cutscene or something. But there wasn't. Alright, so that was a dead end for us. This is... Hmm. I've been here before. Just let our guy regain some sanity. I have a weird feeling that I've been here before. Hmm. Alright. We're back insane. Yeah, remember we had the box with the bowls? Or is this a different place with another box with two bowls? Hmm. Very suspicious. Very suspicious. I doubt they have a license for those box of bowls. You know, those those take a license nowadays. You have to go to the government. You have to submit your A132 paperwork with the title clearly stated, box with bowl permit in, say, in similar, in like enclosed storage unit. Then you have to submit your, all your personal information and then they'll give you a license to store boxes with bowls. And I doubt he has a license. We should go tell the feds. Get him locked up. I, I actually, he's probably dead, so really do much good. Mm. And I've blabbered too much of my guys losing sanity. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Mm. Can I pick that up? No. Just 
just gotta love empty liquor bottles. Oh, don't want screensaver. I need to see my face. Well, I don't, but the camera does. Hmm. Is that blood, or is that from the jam monster of death and doom and despair and smuckers peanut butter infused jelly? It's not a coincidence. Hint of an enemy is near, stay out of sight and hide in the darkness. Stay out of sight, they forget their prepositions. Make sure to turn off your lantern if possible. Hide in the darkness, alright. So we could probably basically hide anywhere around here, I guess. It was kind of a rhetorical question, you guys can't really answer this while I'm live streaming, so it wouldn't really help me too much, but does anyone know what happens when you do get killed by... I mean, can you get killed by the thing? Uh, if, you, if you can, what happens? Do you, like, have to restart from ground zero? And to answer my question, I have my trusty little iPad over here. I told you guys I reserve the right to use the internet. I am curious because I want to know what to do. Well, not really what to do so much as how careful to be. Um, whatever. Random messages involving Facebook posts and pictures. Um, hmm. well, I guess I'll put this here. Oh, this is the interface for the pool I'm working on. I didn't design the interface, but anyway, that was kind of cool. Uh, the thing I designed, let me show you real quick, I'm, I like this. Um, let's go to... Yeah, well, I'll show you guys later, but... Um, Basically, uh, well, I'll show you right now. No, 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 I can't get distracted. All right, amnesia, what happens when you die? When you die. All right, amnesia. Um, hmm. Loading, loading, loading. Just gotta love loading. Alright, so this person asks. Uh, this isn't the first page of the thing. Uh, first. It's page four of eight that I was on. The top profile picture was someone with a potato from uh, Plants vs. Zombies, interestingly enough. Portal Thinker asks, and really scary, I just finished, uh, oh, th it was in reference to the title, Amnesia the Dark Descent is really good and really scary. I just finished playing Amnesia the Dark Descent demo and Bide, should be bought. Uh, the game instantly afterwards. He should. You should totally get it too, especially while it's on sale. It's total. Where does the person ask the question? Um. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go backwards. And maybe, maybe this, maybe this potato guy knows what he's talking about. Potato. He knows where it's at. He says, um. Hmm. Hmm. All right, here we go. Someone, uh, Ryuk asks. I don't know how well you guys can see that. That's, uh, that's Ryuk. Everyone say hi. Ryuk, welcome. So, how long has this problem been plaguing you, Ryuk? Oh, wait, sorry, wrong place. Well, I just managed my longest stint of amnesia 30 minutes. Can anyone tell me what happens when you die, or can you actually die? The game just says, don't worry about saving. The game will take care of that. The problem is, I haven't died yet, so as soon as I see a monster, I run away to a safe place and quit and save. I feel like Tweak from South Park when I'm playing this game, eek. Um, let's see someone who quotes him. I didn't die my first playthrough listening to the commentary. They thoroughly tested the difficulty because they found that if people died, it made the game worse. But uh, if people, if it was too easy, people found it boring. If you keep on your toes, you shouldn't die. Interesting thing they mentioned in the commentary is that should you die, the bit which kills you slightly just so you don't play through the exact same thing again. So it sounds like it takes you back to the last save. Uh, it sounded like these bits that change are the adrenaline sequences. You don't need to quit and save. The Odyssey feature is fine. I found it on my second run through. Listening to the commentary when I decided to finish out to find out what happens when you die. Uh, 
Um, so we don't have to be too terribly careful. We can kind of try some risky things here, which is always fun. Uh, we can kind of... How shall I say it? Um, kind of... Uh, be a little bit more daredevil, so to speak, in this game. We can kind of... And I know the term doesn't really match... Da the term daredevil doesn't really match with gaming, but... You know... A lot of people find the game creepy, and... And I find the barrel throwing to be equally fun as creepy. So, whatever. It all works out in the end. But, uh... Just opening up a bunch of doors here. Uh, if something does come after me, I think I'm going to run into here, was it? No, no, this definitely wasn't the place. Run into here, and... No. I think I'd run over here at the foot of the stairs. And... No, 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 this isn't the right room. I think I'd run into this room. And hide... Alright, come on, where's the one with the dresser? It's obviously none of these. And it's bugging me. Ooh, a map. How convenient. We should probably study it, but instead I'm moving right along. Um, where is the... No, 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 no. Oh, can we throw these bottles up? We had quite a bit of, uh... Was it wine, gin? I don't know. Pick that up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Blah, I got it. Um, cobwebs. Ooh, this place is spooky. Um, not much else to say about it. Uh, it's getting close to 30 minutes here on the recording. I think I'm probably gonna go to 40, 45 or so. Uh, kind of like last time. I think that's a good balance between not getting quite too bored of, you know, watching a commentary play through this and um, also uh, enough that it makes, you know, buffering the video worth your while or whatever you want to call it. Kind of a, it seems like a good length to me, about 45 minutes. Um, any more than that, my commentary starts to run dry, if it hasn't already. Uh, so, whatever. I really need to find that room with the dresser, because it's going to really come in handy at some point if I get chased by something. I was just here, wasn't I? I'm through here... You know, even though I find I'm not going to remember where it is, so... If I get chased by him, I'm just going to run into a random room, and I have, what, a win in 5-6 chance? Not too good of odds, but whatever. Might be able to just hide in the dark, too. Turn my lantern off, you know? And how's my guy's sanity? A slight headache. We're still good there. Um, there's got to be something more to these archives than just that. There's got to be something I'm missing. All right, I'm going to do a thorough search. All right, this room, anything, anything at all? No. Come on, monster! I want to face you. I'll grab one of those razor blades off of. Hey, I found it! Ah, huh. so can I get in here and close the door? They'll never find me in here thing is the game, which uh, is the same game that runs the script or bot or AI engine that runs the uh, monster or whatever, does in fact know you're in here. So when he doesn't find you, he's just bluffing. He knows you're there. Doesn't that help you with your playthrough on Asia, knowing he knows you're there, but that he chooses not to attack you because the programmers wrote the AI bot to let you be safe in some areas? They're really giving you a break there. Um, and watch me completely forget all that, right? This looks like some interesting stuff to pick up. A note! Ooh, are you ready for a cutscene note? Are you ready? Are they gonna read it? Oh boy, I get to read it. My name is Wilhelm, House of Gerich. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle of Brennenburg. I guess that, that you don't need the of. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what the supposed Knight of the Order could want from me, and accepted the invitation. The barn was friendly and offered me a proposition. Um, I, I pronounced aristocracy wrong, sorry about that. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid, and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I've been rewarded with during my times as a soldier. Time, sorry, singular. 
I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking any questions. I inserted the word any. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly, and I accepted wholeheartedly. Um, looks like it might go on for a while. Ever since that day, I have brought men, women, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Ooh. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The barn has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. They should probably have a hyphen there. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer dot dot dot. And then the message ends. Just at the moment where something was interesting was going to happen in the letter, it ends. How do you like? How do you like that? All right. So I'm not going to bother wa wasting Tinder on that. Hey, look, a bowl. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, put the bowl on the box. Now carry that box. If you don't know what I'm imitating, it's don't worry. Uh, you probably don't want to know. Um, but in case you do want to know, uh, look up the Lonely Island and search for a song with the title "Box" with the word "box" in its title. Now uh, I can't tell whether these are human remains or something else. They're kind of like I don't know. I think they are. I'm gonna assume they are. So, back with my bull box idea. Hey, this could be a boom box, if only we could find a boom. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, the box is happy. So happy its hat's flying off. And... I think that's the saddest part in this game so far. No, but continuing on. Um, what time are we at? About 32 minutes. Alright, so record for another 10 minutes or so. I'm not seeing anything of much interest here, to be honest. Um, sanity is crystal clear, surprisingly. It's amazing. I don't think I've ever had crystal clear sanity in this game. Not that I know of, anyway. Um, see, I don't know why you can't grab one of these hammers and fight, you know. I got the four spotter, as James would say, you know. I wonder why you can't do that. Or grab the razor blade and, like, you know, cut his head off, you know, throw it at him. I don't know. Maybe I'm a little bit violent and gruesome, but... It seems illogical. So I have a wooden plank, and I place this on the wall. Because I must admit, these interior designers did a horrible job. Um, here's a chair. I found a chair. We are getting nowhere in this game. I am sorry. I'm trying to find... Uh, they can't just have it. Well, I guess they could. But I doubt they have an area with absolutely no use. I'm sure it has some kind of value or something to find. Something I can light. How's my sanity doing now? Crystal clear. Wow, I'm impressed. See, here's more of those hammers. I'm hungry. Did you know that if you chew your food thoroughly, less of it gets converted into body fat? Because it goes through your digestive system faster? Good thing to know. I've been trying to chew my food more thoroughly lately. <laughs> now, I'm not fat or anything, but I could lose a couple of pounds and not really be upset about it. <laughs> um, I my BMI is like, I don't even know what it was anymore. Calculated it in health, but... It was like just a little bit above average. Not bad, but you know, why add to it, right? Now I don't see anything much around here. Um 
I guess this area really was kind of a little bit pointless. I, I don't know. I'll go back to the entrance hall, see if there's anything of interest there. Or, you know, I could look it up and see what, what to do. Um, yeah, I'll try to find it on my own. Try to find this myself. There was text that I probably could read if I wanted to. So I'm back here and something's shaking. Hmm. It appears the gem monster has been present here recently. I can feel the gem monster near me. Ooh. No, but seriously. It's kind of gross. Oops. That's right, the jam monster doesn't like me cram uh, cramping his style with his jam. What's my health doing? A few cuts and bruises, slight headache. Dang it, we don't have crystal clear sanity anymore. We could make it over to there, but we have to run across the jam, which wouldn't be optimal. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting how you can open a box while you're standing on its lid. Not weird at all. What if we can do chair stacking? That's a new idea. And the answer is no! Myth busted! Eh, it was never a myth. It's an idea. A fragment of one at best. Well, this doesn't seem to be very fruitful. Uh, I think I'm just going to end the recording here. We will be back next time, and I will read through the guides and kind of figure out what I'm going to do next. So, thank you for joining me. Uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, Amnesia, although we didn't get much done. I'm sorry. It's kind of slow moving game I suppose at least when I play it so thank you for joining me and I will see you next time and remember to remake your reses on the Minecraft server